Yo, what is going on YouTube? It's your boy Stilo back with another video and uh, I'm back. Uh, yeah, I'm back. Uh, my computer is now fixed. So yes, regular Pokemon Showdown videos will be coming back and uh, yes, I was Pokemaster J and I did change my name to Stilo if you haven't noticed and uh, I am on my Pokemaster J account on Showdown and I'm around 1250 on the ladder. I have other accounts, uh, PK Steez. That's around 1400, 1500. Uh, but this one I kind of want to rank up today. So, anyways, today's team is the Mega Pinsir Spike, uh, Mega Pinsir Spike Stack team. Uh, let's go ahead and find a, a match. But uh, this team is based around Mega Pinsir, of course, and Spike Stacking with Klefki and Stealth Rocks with Heat Ran. Uh, Stormy is a hazard control. It's defensive Stormy, so it can easily wrap a sprint any anything away. Uh, as you see, my opponent has a defogger, so um, we can use that to our, our advantage. Um, his most likely lead is definitely going to be the Heat Ran or the Swampert. Uh, so I will most likely want to lead off his Starmie. Um, if he does lead off his Zapdos, which I don't necessarily have a switch into it, but I do have Heat Ran in the bag, special defensive Heat Ran. So I'm going to go ahead and lead off his Starmie right here, and he does lead off with. Um, Jane here is most likely well is definitely well definitely mega mega Gardevoir here yes and he goes he goes in and sets up a calm mind uh, I'm gonna magma storm here uh, try to trap him in and then toxic uh, he does land a focus blast and I do fortunately land a magma storm so that's always good um, I'm gonna go ahead and protect here so he can take more damage and then we'll set him on rocks. Uh he win is definitely gonna have to go down. I'm sure that wouldn't have killed. But um I'm gonna go ahead and set up rocks here. And uh okay, so I do go down. And um 328. I could easily um come in with Jirachi. And he's probably going to want to keep this, so I'm going to go ahead and U-turn, hoping that he does switch out, which he does. So he switched out into Swamper, who's most likely holding Rocky Helmet, which it isn't, uh, which is good. But I get to pivot out into Superior, and I'm actually going to go ahead and fire off a Glare, because he's definitely going to switch into his Heat Ran here. Or maybe uh, keep in um, his Swampy, but uh, that's always nice. I can actually set up, nah, I think it's best to just fire off a leaf storm killing swampy here and uh i'm gonna have to switch out probably star me okay so switches out into bird here i don't necessarily have a switch in for this Zapdos is usually run as special defensive. It's probably going to heat ray. This thing covers my whole team with heat ring down. Ooh, I shouldn't have let heat ring go down. Wait, what? Okay, we take those. Alright, so this guy has a really somewhat bulky team. Pinsir should be able to break through with at least one Swords Dance. Uh, his most likely lead is definitely the, um, it's gonna call it Ferrothorn, it's the um, Fortress. So I'm gonna lead off his Heat Ran here. As he actually leads off Crocodile, so. Damn. Another thing that I don't have really a pivot for go straight for knockoff ridiculous <laughs> gonna have to let this go down um gladly it's not moxie but i'm gonna go ahead and bring a superior here and uh fire for glare because he's definitely switching out to volcarona i shouldn't be predicting my opponent too hard because over predicting usually leads off to downfalls but i do predict it right and that thing is actually carrying a Lumberry, which is interesting. 
but I'm actually going to switch out into my Tran and uh, fire up a Magma Storm and that should do me pretty well because I can Toxic Slowbro if it decides to come in on the Magma Storm so um, that's always nice as he actually decides to double interesting I'm gonna just Magma Storm here he actually switches out into Slowbro which is good because I actually landed so he's actually trapped in and I can go ahead and fire off a Toxic making sure that um, it can actually go down Skull is not going to do too much because um, Skull Bros usually run his defensive and I'm max special defense and you know he runs one of the most special defensive mon in the game so I'm actually going to go ahead and protect here as he's probably going to fire off another Skull and I'm going to get my leftovers back up and I'm going to go ahead and fire off uh, um, I'm going to go ahead and put up Stealth Rock as he's probably going to slack off as he does and um um so magma storm plus toxic is doing a decent amount of damage we're gonna go ahead and fire off another magma storm which i do unfortunately miss but he slacks off again and he's free so i wonder if he's gonna switch out he's definitely switching out so he switches out Will he switch out? Who does he have a switch in the? He doesn't. Just fire off another magma storm. Please land though. Thank you. Okay. And here I can just fire off protect. I'm pretty sure it's choice scarf because he only used knockoff the first time. So he, he does fire off an earthquake, which I can actually come in with pincer, and he forfeits another. Uh, another forfeit, but we did reach 1311 on the ladder. I'm gonna go ahead and find another match. Alright, so this guy has a Mew, which will probably be his lead. Um, I gotta watch out for his Choice Scarf Jirachi, as I also do have a Choice Scarf Jirachi. So I might lead off my own Jirachi just to get a U turn, get some U turn damage on something because he doesn't necessarily have a resist to it. So I'm gonna go ahead and. Uh, start with Jirachi and just go ahead and U-turn so he actually brings out his own Jirachi and I'm just gonna U-turn here and um, he does the same but U-turn damage should do a decent amount so I'm not too worried because he has to pivot out into something so here comes a Charizard oh I'm actually gonna Thunder Wave this I think that would be my best play. I didn't use much spikes at all this whole entire video, but Thunder Raving seems like the best play here because I don't have uh, an option for this. Because if it's X and it has Earthquake, he ran goes down and Klefki, I could Thunder Rave and then probably set up a Sword Stance with Pinsir hoping on his paralysis or just coming with Starmie. But if he's Y, then he could just, um, solo beam me which will be problematic so I'm definitely gonna just lead off we'll come in with Klefki and fire off a thunder wave because that, that's definitely my best play here as he does not mega evolve which means he's X which is good I can actually come in with Starmie here and just start Skull um, so he's gonna mega evolve probably Outrage or you know, something Dragon Claw which does a, a hell of a lot of damage which is okay I guess but I could just um, recover that and hopefully get a mm. let's call it again dragon dance I'm gonna scald one more time it's probably going to roost here oh he's paralyzed he paralyzed see that was the best play for me to do definitely paralyze the charge that was definitely the best play to, for me to um, for me to do because there was no way I was gonna able to stop that um, I am defensive Starmie, so I'm just gonna fire off a skull. Hopefully, hopefully get the burn. He get, oh wow, that does a lot. That's banded. Um, that's definitely banded. That's definitely banded. So I'm actually going to Mega Evolve and just go for the return. <laughs> As he does come in with Rotom and. I do a decent amount. I doubt uh, close combat will kill, so I'm going to switch out into Heatran. 
I wonder if he's off the fence. He goes with Thunder Wave. Um, so he's definitely not offensive. I could definitely set up rocks here. Or even go for Toxic. I think... I think Magma Stormer might be my best play. So he's definitely special defensive due to that damage right there. And he's, cold, he's holding the Citrus Berry. I'm going to protect here as he takes damage from the Magma Storm. He goes for Volt Switch, which is interesting. Knowing that he's going for Volt Switch, I kind of want to Toxic. But then again, I could actually set up my rocks and uh, maintain some of all the switching that he's doing. Um, see, if I set up rocks... He's definitely switching out into Azu if he um both switches. I well if I double out into Superior, it, the vote switch is just gonna help him in that case, and he'll probably switch on to Chirachi or Latios. Then again, I could set of rocks. Yeah, I'm I'm, I'm gonna set of rocks. Oh, we actually decided to stay in. So I set up rocks and um, I'm gonna protect here. Cause he's definitely gonna vote switch here. Oh, he actually goes for the Hydro Pump again. I'm gonna take that Magma Storm damage. And um, do I need Heat Ran? I could use it as fodder against something more dangerous. So. I want Cupkey healthy because it's defensive and it, it could most it could definitely take a hit from a zoom rule and I could just, I could thunder rate that so that'd be nice. Um think about switching on a superior here. As he does land another hydro pump. And I could set up sub here. As she goes with Thunder Wave, perfect. Okay. Now I'm gonna just go ahead and fire off a Leaf Storm here and get my special attack up. That's perfect for me. That is absolutely perfect. Okay. Now what? Now who is he gonna switch out into? I think I'm doing pretty well here. There's no way he's stopping me. So he's definitely gonna come in with Jirachi. It's most, it's definitely Choice Scarf. So I'm definitely gonna glare here. At, ooh, he's U turn. Probably should have leaked. Actually, he's probably going to switch out into Latios. So. Ooh, he switched out into Mew. Damn, synchronized. Okay. Bad situation. Oh. Ooh, nice. That is not a special defensive Mew. What is that? That is nice. Usually, well, I usually want defensive, uh, special defensive move. It's gonna come in with Muddy Buddy, which I'm pretty sure I OKO with Leaf Storm, but he OKOs me. It's cool. I can definitely go for Thunder Wave here. And I, I have no reason to set a spike since he does have Latios in the bag, so. But I do want to lay out, lay out one layer just for Jirachi as he goes for another play rough. I think I might set up another. Actually, no, I'm going to play rough here just in case he switches out in the Latios. Because um, if he does switch out in the Latios, then that would be a problem. So I'm going to just play rough here, do a decent amount, and lower his attack, which is even better for me. So I'm going to go ahead and lay, out, lay down another layer of spikes that he does switch out into Latios, which was unexpected. But I can actually Thunder Wave that. Making sure that Jirachi can have a possible way to um possible way to sweep. Which I can trick here. But I don't but the the problem with tricking here is that Azumarill is choice banded and his his own Jirachi is also choice scarf, so if I trick, I could possibly get another choice item back. So I'm thinking about you turning out into Heran. 
So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna U-turn out into Heat Ram, making sure Latios is weak enough, which it is now. And let's see what he does. He's probably gonna defog. I probably should have tricked him because of. Oh, he has the HP fires. Perfect for me. Perfect. So Magma Storm is definitely gonna KO this beast. He actually goes to Draco Meteor. I eat that up. Hopefully I'm, I break through and land. Which I don't break through, which is unfortunate, but I can not protect here, which I can't even get that off. But I do live. Holy shit, that is so weak. And protect here. Just so I can have this as death fire. So that way I can have something to come back in on his next switch in. So Draco Meter only did 12.4% when he was at half special attack. So I should be able to live this one unless he gets a crit which he doesn't so i'm definitely going i probably should have hmm. i'm actually good i'm still in a good position i'm at 11 percent azu and jirachi is going to take a decent amount a decent chunk from this um from stealth rock plus spikes so i'm actually going to protect here and i do not break through again but i do eat up the iron head which he is actually locked into. I want to protect. A, oh my God! Can I get a protect, please, so I can live two of these, two of these iron heads, please? God damn it, man! That is bullshit. That's complete fucking bullshit. But with that pincer, actually, does he? Oh my God! He ran. Why did you have to be paralyzed twice? That's ridiculous, man. Mm. Bad situation. Do I out? I do out speed. Um. Cause choice bandit Azuma was never. I'm actually gonna switch on to Raji. Yes. Okay. And just U turn here. As he actually decides to switch out, which was a bad play on him. Because I can actually come back in with my own heat ran. Bam. That's it. That's game. GG. Oh, no. Actually, if Magma Storm can land and I break through, please break through. Oh, wait. No, I still win with Jirachi with Iron Head, right? Iron Head plus Quirk Attack, I still win. He has Aqua Dread, but I still win. I still win. I should be able to eat at least one of these um, Aqua Dreads. Well, I actually eat two of them up, so that's it. That's a good game. Cool. Alright. And where are we at on this recording? We're at 18 minutes, so I guess one more match. To show off this team and I'm definitely going to be doing a team builder on this team because it's actually really good on the low ladders because of the spike stacking not many people on the low ladder use defog or rapid spin such as Escudio, Starmie, um, Zapdos and Lan uh, Latios so Klefki and uh, Heat Rank could really do a lot of work in the lower ladders like I said this team is really weak to um I forgot who we were weak who were, we were weak to earlier. Definitely weak to ground. Uh, if Pincer's not Mega Evolver, definitely weak to ground. Uh, Superior could do a lot, but against Crocodile, like we had earlier, we had a, we could have had a lot of trouble with that if he didn't forfeit. I don't know why he forfeited it. Um, he could have easily won that game. But we're in the next game, and this dude has a, a shell gone, which is weird, but... I feel like it has explosion. That's probably the reason why he has it. So I'm going to lead off with Clef. So he actually decides to lead off with Heat Ran. Interesting. Um, if he's Earth Power, my Heat Ran doesn't even have. Oh, my Heat Ran can't even do anything against this. Okay, so I'm just going to Thunder Wave on his most likely Stealth Rock. But he's actually paralyzed, which is good. I'm just going to go ahead and throw out spikes. He does have a rapid spinner. And he decides to taunt. 
So I'm gonna go ahead and switch out to Starmie. As he goes for his own rocks. I'm gonna just go out here. As he switches out into Rotom. Now don't get the burn. Probably going to Bolt Switch. Look, his team is going to be really problematic because of Bolt Switch and Heat Ran. I just noticed I forgot to change my sprite. Um, I don't want Rachi coming in because he's probably he, just in case he carries Thunder Wave. Um. Think about switching out a heat ran. But I could have a lot of trouble if he decides to full switch here and bring out extra drill against my heat ran. I'll have a lot of trouble. And I need these rocks away to bring in my own pincer. What about superior? I'm gonna go ahead and bring in superior. As he does decide to full switch as I thought he would. That would probably would have been very problematic if I kept him storming. This is gonna be a hard fight, hard uh, battle to win. Definitely gonna be a hard battle to win. Um, so I'm actually good just to switch out in the cleft key here against his fake out and all that. He definitely doesn't want this to be paralyzed, so I'm going to bring in Pincer here and hope that I can get the close combat off on his um key ran. Which he actually doesn't even decide to bring in. I guess he was... Mm, maybe I shouldn't have made that double. Oh my god. Very bad situation now. Very bad situation. But I'm going to bring in heat right now. Jesus. Oh, we really was. Perfect. Okay. So I could toxic this. Yes. He is offensive. Toxic man, or protect here, and then Magma Storm doing a shit ton of damage. And then He Ran is probably gonna go down, but do I truly need He Ran? I probably do against the Reunion because, but knowing that he's somewhat offensive, I should be able to. Well, if I land the Magma Storm, that is. He is going for hydro pumps. So I could I could bring in superior and fire up a leaf storm, which would do a hell of a lot of damage to you. basically everybody. Or I can also uh, set up a sub. I'm just gonna fire up a magma storm. As he actually decides to vote switch, I'm hoping, I'm hoping, I'm hoping he doesn't bring in his own heat ring. Thank you. Please land. Oh my god, no, come on, oh my god, okay, I'm gonna protect here to start the mm, power punch, I lived that actually, I lived that, he actually goes for high jump kick, Jesus man, that's bullshit, Okay, I need to gain some momentum, so I'm thinking about going as Jirachi, you turning out on, he's probably going to switch out, so I'm going to go ahead and bring in Rachi, you turn out, Let's see, man, I have a hard time dealing with Rotom. Oh my god, that Magma Storm miss really set me way back. Okay, Pincer, you can actually come in now. Oh my god. I'm gonna have to heal and wish Pincer up later. Because I'm gonna have a hard time against this team. And without Pincer, there's really nothing I can do. That should do it. Oh my god, that doesn't do much at all. Fuck. I have to bring in superior here. There's no way I'm staying in on that. If only I had stealth rocks up. 
I should have definitely put up rocks. <sighs> if I had stealth rocks up, then Rotom would have went down. Okay. Best play here. Damn, man. I lose this match, yo. I'm already losing. Switch on to Jirachi. As he goes a high jump kick and it does so much damage, it's ridiculous. Why is this open? chance I have of winning somewhat at least choice scarf I lose bye anyways guys if you enjoyed this episode go ahead and leave a like um yeah I'm definitely gonna cover this team later but I'm definitely gonna cover up its weaknesses uh because it does have a lot of weaknesses especially against other opposing heat rants uh because it's only option it's a close combat from pincer so the only problem with this team but anyways if you enjoyed this video go ahead and leave a like and i'll see you guys later peace